Washington, AP, the Supreme Court began hearing arguments Friday on major Biden administration efforts to bump up the nation's vaccination rate against COVID-19 at a time of spiking coronavirus cases because of the Omicron variant. The justices on the conservative-oriented court were taking up the questions of whether to allow the administration to enforce a vaccine or testing requirement that applies to large employers in a separate vaccine mandate for most healthcare workers. The arguments were expected to last at least two hours. Legal challenges to the policies from Republican-led states and business groups are in their early stages, but the outcome at the high court probably will determine the fate of boxing requirements affecting more than 80 million people. I think effectively what is at stake is whether these mandates. The trade group is not involved in the Supreme Court cases. Challengers argue that the boxing rules exceed the administration's authority, but Solicitor General Elizabeth Freelaga, the administration's top Supreme Court lawyer, wrote that both are needed to avoid unnecessary hospitalizations and deaths. Keeping the vaccine mandate for healthcare workers on hold will likely result in hundreds or thousands of deaths and serious illnesses from COVID-19 that could otherwise be prevented, Freelaga wrote. Nearly 207 million Americans, 62. 3% of the population, are fully vaccinated, and more than a third of the country has received a booster shot, including the nine justices. The court said Friday that Justice Sonia Sotomayor would not be on the bench with her colleagues, opting instead to take part remotely from her office at the court, 